We are continuing the conversation on the push to legalize marijuana in Texas with Dr. Eddie Carter from Prairie View A&M University. Good morning and thank you for joining us. Good morning, Jose. Thank you. Now, what do you think has given the renewed momentum to legalize marijuana here in the state of Texas? There are a couple of things, Jose. Uh, one of those is uh, probably the most recent decision regarding uh, a judge blocking a state from criminalizing uh, marijuana extract. I think it's Delta 18. And so that has given renewed momentum. Secondly, the other issue that really is a big issue uh, is the uh, candidacy of uh, Beto O'Rourke for governor of the state of Texas. Beto O'Rourke has not made any, uh, has not had any hesitation with regard to verbalizing his support for the legalization of marijuana. And so uh, that's another factor. A third factor is uh, the fact that there's a grassroots movement by local politicians in major Texas cities in order to get the legalization of marijuana on the ballot. So those things are all coming together to provide a strong context for making the argument on behalf of the legalization of marijuana. You mentioned Beta O'Rourke, but uh, Joe Jaworski, a candidate for AG here in the state, he called petty prosecutions of those who are being taken to jail for marijuana. Yes, uh, we're, we've seen somewhat of a shift in the state of Texas with regard to uh, prosecutions uh, with regard to the issue of marijuana possession, et cetera, and mar alleged ma marijuana crimes. And also there's been a relaxation of enforcement with regard to general uh, marijuana laws. And so that trend indicates that uh, there's a shift taking place at the local levels. Police departments would thereby be uh, freed up in order to address uh, significant crimes in the, in the cities, which seems to be becoming uh, even more increased uh, in these days. Dr. Carter, do you think there's going to be support from Republican candidates? Because right now it's just the Democrats. It's very interesting. Uh, there, there are some grassroots movements like such as Republicans Against Marijuana Prohibition, uh, who is for, they are for uh, the legalization of marijuana. So they're lobbying the governor thus far to no effect. Uh, on the other hand, uh, while there is grassroots support for the legalization of marijuana in the state of Texas, there does not seem to be any significant leadership support for the, among the Republicans for the support of uh, the legalization of marijuana. So there's a disconnect essentially between grassroots Republicans and, and citizens and the leadership of the Republican Party in the state of Texas. So uh, it, it looks as though we're, we're going to have to wait on that to, to, to emerge and see if voters can influence, Republican voters can influence Republican candidates and leaders. Now, what do you think is the biggest argument for the legalization of marijuana here in Texas? <sighs> It's an argument, interestingly enough, that at this juncture doesn't really seem to receive a lot of attention, and that is going to be the economic argument. It has been proposed that uh, if marijuana is legalized in the state of Texas, then that could give very significant amounts of revenue for the state of Texas in order to spend on needs in this time of budgetary crisis. Uh, up to $1 billion would be made available if we followed the guidelines of the state of Colorado with regard to this issue. That seems to be the strong uh, argument with regard to the legalization of marijuana, but it's not receiving a lot of attention thus far. Uh, the other argument, the counter argument to that is uh, the legalization of marijuana would lead to other problems which would cost uh, money in a different fashion. But the economic argument seems to be uh, the best argument. We know that politicians love money and need money in order to carry out their programs. So that would seem to be the strongest argument that can be made. Thank you very much. Dr. Eddie Carter with some insight into the possibility of the legalization of marijuana here in the state of Texas. Thank, Thank you, Doc. You. Thank you, Jose.